Hello, I'm Claudia from Harmit.es and in this video tutorial I want to explain you how you can easily change the color of any of my watercolor paintings. To show you I'm gonna be using one of my clip arts and you can download a free sample from the description of this video so you can follow the tutorial with me. Okay, so the first clip art I'm gonna be using is this balloon and the easiest way to change the color is by going to Image, Adjustments and Open Hue Saturation. Once you have this panel, you can move the hue and you can get many new colors. So let's say you want this purple color, you press OK and here you have it. But what happens if you want this to be editable? You want to save it as a PSD and you want to open it again and change again the color. So what I recommend you to do in this case is to apply the same effect but as a layer mask. So to do it we will be using this other example so that we can compare and once you have it open you open your layer panels which is in window layers and once you have this layer selected imagine you have here multiple layers or you only have one you just need to select the one you want to change the color and go down here to this symbol when you click you will find the same effect hue saturation so it will open the same kind of panel you can move it around and change the color let's say we want it in yellow in this time and in case you have multiple layers remember to bring your cursors in between of both layers and pressing alt it will appear this symbol you can click and now this effect this changing color it's only affecting to this layer okay now finally what will happen if you want to apply a change of color to a watercolor painting that has multiple colors and you only want to change the color of some areas so as example we're going to be using this watercolor leaf and we can do the same we can press here hue saturation change the tone and as you can see while it's changing the tone of the leaves it's still changing also the tone of the berries so in case you want to maintain the berries in the original color what you will do is once you have this you come back to layers you press alt in between both layers to apply it to the only one you want and here this white area it's a layer mask which means that all that is white here will be applying this um, this filter but if we paint over this white area in black it will be like a window like if we were making a mask and everything that is in black it's it's not gonna be applying here it's gonna be like not applying the filter so to do it we just need to select our brush select the color in black click here and paint over the areas you don't want. As you can see it's directly taking the original color and now if you want to edit again the change and change the color you can double click over here it will open again the hue panel and you can move it around and as you can see the red it's never changing. Okay so I hope you find this helpful let me know in the comments if you like it or if you have any doubts and see you in the next tutorial.